Hi and welcome to Chamonix and this week's video report. Although we've had slightly milder temperatures in the last few days, there's still been a fair amount of cloud around as well. But this didn't dampen people's spirits early in the week when we saw the return of the popular Cosmo Jazz Festival. The first performance of this free event took place at Mere Glass, where I see Samawi and his band performed a number of songs infused with African beats and rhythms from Morocco and Senegal. They created a great atmosphere and this continued in the evening when several bands played at different locations around the town centre. The festival continues until Sunday and you can check the times and venues of all the performances by visiting our news page. If you fancy something active, the Chamonix Valley offers a number of trails for some great mountain biking. There are around 20 marked circuits that run all the way through from Sevors, Lesuge, Chamonix all the way to Valocine. The trails vary in length from between 7 to 30 kilometers, and some of the best known are the Petit Bacon north and south. Le Bois, about 2 kilometers north of Chamonix, offers trails for all abilities, but if it's the downhill thrill you're after, the summer lift system gives easy access to the valley's downhill runs that provide exciting descents of up to 1500 meter vertical height difference. Now this year it's easier than ever to explore the different areas with the introduction of a new free bicycle transport service specially equipped with bicycle racks. And if you want to make the most of the biking opportunities here in Chamonix, you can head out with one of the qualified mountain bike guides. At the moment with all the rain we've been having, most tracks are obviously pretty wet and slippery, but a lot of the cross country routes are sheltered by trees, so although it's wet under wheel, you shouldn't get too soaked on a ride. You will get very muddy though. Now it's forecasted that the weather will remain rather unsettled, but the good news is that we should see warmer temperatures and a bit more sunshine towards the end of the weekend and into next week. Thank you very much for watching and bye for now.